what is up guys welcome back to the channel it's your favorite homegirl ashley and i am back at it again with another video today's video is actually this is a vlog welcome back to the vlog guys <laughs> um this is going to be a vlog as you guys can see omari and i are pulling out the painting kit this is the same painting kit that i showed you guys in my previous video he begged me to pull out this painting kit so um yeah as you guys can see i'm kind of getting the kit ready um, he was so freaking excited to experiment with the colors and mix them. Uh, he was able to create purple. Uh, he realized that if you mix red and blue together that you can create purple. So that was a really exciting moment for him. Um, one thing I can say is next time we do this activity, I will definitely be sure to do it outside versus in the house um we couldn't really enjoy it as much as i wish we would have because i didn't i didn't go outside i believe it was raining that day um and i wanted to make sure we didn't get paint on the table so that was another thing but he really enjoyed the painting kit and i'll also leave this down below in the description box he really enjoyed it he had a lot of fun just experimenting with the colors and mixing them um so i'm super proud of him i am really proud of him this was a really cool activity and i actually have more canvases i believe the kit comes with about six or seven canvases so we will be doing this painting activity again um but yeah next time we'll definitely do it outside he was so upset and hurt when we had to put the painting kit up but I just did not want him to get paint all over the table and the floor because guys it would have been a complete mess okay so oh look at his painting so uh, he went ahead and he completed his painting um, he really enjoyed playing around with the colors and creating new colors but yeah guys definitely if you're interested i'll leave the link to the painting kit down below in the description box make sure that you guys go and check it out and let me know if you purchased it and how your kids enjoyed it once again welcome back to the vlog and i hope that you guys enjoy this video love you guys so much and don't forget to hit that subscribe button thank you thank you thank you love you guys bye hey guys so in my previous video i told you guys about my new hobby that i found in jewelry making and you know making waist beads and stuff like that so after me and omari wrapped up our painting session i went ahead and pulled out my jewelry making kit my beading kit and i went ahead and made me some more waist beads I already have four waist beads on i think i made two waist beads that night um so yeah this is just me showing you how i make the waist beads um playing around with the color schemes and actually this particular um waist bead that i made actually unraveled when i was trying to put it on and all the beads came off so i had to redo it all over um, but I love beading. I love making waist beads. I love playing around with the color schemes and charms So this is something that I kind of do to Relax my mind and just you know, like a hobby that I like doing um, To like I said relax my mind and give myself something to do So as you guys can see I'm just putting on the waist beads and measuring them tying them around my waist and I love all of my waist beads so much they mean so much to me and uh, I just love making waist beads and playing around with the color schemes and the charms they are so freaking pretty so yeah guys Um, 
I've been trying to film this vlog for about three days now. And, and I have yet to get it together, honey. Sis is looking crazy. I'm still in Atlanta, obviously. I'm not in my bathroom. I just clocked out of work. I just clocked out. Oops. I just got off of work. I'm actually supposed to be, okay. So, Omari and Tony. Tony is my boyfriend. Omari is my son. For those of you who don't know, they are both at a family party. Um, I'm actually gonna meet them there. So, yeah. My hair, I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. I actually put some um, twist in my hair so I can get that same. If you watched my last video um, and seen how my hair was like really pretty, really full, um, that's how I got, I get it. I got that style by basically doing these like twists um, so I just moisturize my hair really, really good. This is what I use. <sighs> Wild Hair Grow. And then I also use this right here. Hopefully it focuses this time. But I recently started using this oil and I absolutely love it. And I'll have it linked down below in the description. It's for your hair, your skin, and your nails. Um, I need to take out my twisties, get my hair together, get dressed because I'm meeting Tony and Omari at this family get together thing. Um, so yeah, I've already taken a shower, just clocked out. My bag is secured. <laughs> um, yeah, what else did I want to talk to you guys about? There's a few things. Let's head to the kitchen. Let's get out of here. Okay. Okay, so guys, in my last video, I did talk to you guys about the, um, I did talk to you guys about this product right here. This is the Upful Blends um, Cellular Protector and Balancer. And they look like this. I don't think I opened them for you guys in my last video. So they look like this. And actually, when I first talked about this product, um, I had no affiliate links for it or anything like that. But I recently, well, yesterday, I became a brand ambassador for the Upful Blends brand. So if you want to purchase this product, my affiliate link is going to be down below in the description box. This week, I want to try to book an appointment to go see an esthetician or maybe a dermatologist. I don't know. Somebody who can help me figure out what's best. But I know for a fact I can either get some like micro needling done or a microdermabrasia. Microdermabrasion. One of those things. I'll figure it out, but I know I need something done to that degree. But my skin is feeling a lot better. Aloe vera is so calming and soothing for the skin. So that has helped me a lot. But I'm going to go ahead now and take my pills for the day. I forgot, so I'm going to go ahead and take them now. Mm. I know some people have problems with taking pills. I don't, I don't have a problem with taking pills. I don't, some people like gag and stuff like that. I don't, um, I don't have a problem at all. And these are huge. One thing I can say about them, these products are great for, for all kinds of people from all different walks of life. With these products, I noticed I was going to the bathroom, like doing the number one and the number two, like a lot, a lot, a lot. But that's simply because this product is used to remove toxins from your body. Taking these products and drinking lots of water. I've been drinking lots of water. And so yeah, that's what I've been doing. 
now what else did i want to talk to you guys about i'm super excited i i have to write a, a list for everything i write everything down because the only way i feel the only way for something to become real and the only way for you to really manifest something it could be the most smallest things like for example i just purchased myself something because i said i wanted to start a new business um it's been on my heart to try this new business venture but i wrote it down what i wanted to buy myself and i just bought it so i feel like for me personally when you write something down it's just it manifests so quickly like when i look back over the things that i've written down um since the beginning of 2021 up until this point everything i've written down i've been able to achieve i've been able to obtain or it's in the works right now so get you a pen and a paper make that shit reality write that shit down and go after whatever it is that you want like god one thing i know is that god will make a way like no matter what and that's that's all i know that's all i can tell you so okay so i got that out of the way and y'all this is a long list of stuff but and i just wrote this list the other day this is basically a list of things that I need to do or buy. Um, so, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. There's 16 things on this list. I've already checked off two, and I created this list two days ago. So, we got my boyfriend's Father's Day gifts out of the way. Um... I purchased the thing that I wanted to purchase for me, which I'll talk about in my next video. Um, and then, as a matter of fact, and the crazy thing is, sometimes when you check some things off, you end up adding some things. So, I have one more thing I need to add. Mm. Oh yeah, two more things I need to add. See? Check two things off, and then I added two things back to the list, but that's life, that's just how shit goes. So a few of these things are things that I'm not gonna rush the process. I just wrote them down to keep them in the forefront of my mind, but a few of these things are things that I cannot rush them. These are things that have to happen organically, and that's just that, you know? Um. I'm only here in Atlanta. I've been here in Atlanta for two weeks now. I'm only here for another um, one week. Today makes one week that I have here left in Atlanta. I'm leaving here on Father's Day um, on the 20th, on June 20th. So, but the only reason that I'm actually leaving is because Elmari has soccer camp back at home. Um, so that's gonna be really exciting as well. But once he finishes soccer camp, it's only like a four day camp. It was the only sport available um, through my county's recreation department or whatever. I don't know how to explain it, but it was the only sport available that was in his age range that he can actually participate in this summer. And it was, it's only four days, but he's so high energy and I don't know if sports is gonna be his thing. Like he's super, in my, I'm talking about my son guys, for those of you who don't know. Like my son is like super into gaming. Like he's like the gamer kid. He sees, you know, mommy editing and making videos on YouTube. And he sees me working online and doing all this stuff. So I don't know if he's really gonna be into sports because I see him leaning more into tech. Um, but I thought, he's a kid, he's a boy, it's summertime, let's, you know, keep him moving, keep him going. So I thought that soccer would be a great way to, you know, test out his strength and test out his ability to play sports. 
So this is gonna be the first sport that he's ever played. He's five years old. And I wanted to do something outside of just like basketball or football. So I thought that soccer would be really great for him. So yeah, so I only have one more week left here. I need to go ahead and get ready because my boyfriend and my son are waiting on me. So let me figure out what I'm gonna wear. And y'all, we gotta figure out what we gonna do to this hair. I feel like my hair just be driving me crazy. All right, so we're back in the bathroom <laughs> again. I don't know okay I'll come back once I figured out like what I'm gonna do because I have no idea what I'm gonna do right now so let me figure this out and I'll be back all right guys so this is what I was able to come up with this is what I was able to come up with I'm dressed I might change this shirt I don't know All right, there's one thing that I did want to talk to you guys about. I got to make this quick because I got to go. But right now, my channel is not like a niche channel. Like, I don't have one particular thing that I talk about because I'm still trying to figure out what I want my channel to be about. Mostly, my channel has consisted of vlogs, beauty, and um, how-tos and stuff like that. But right now, I'm just putting out content because I like creating, I like editing, I like filming. I just love creating content. So I, I feel like moving forward, I'm kind of getting a feel of what I want to offer. I feel like if I do like really, really niche down, um i'll probably create like another channel but as of right now on this channel it's just it's just i don't know what it is i don't know i don't know what it is i don't know what's going on here <laughs> but i'll figure it out one thing i can say is if you enjoy my content don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to leave this video a big thumbs up. And I thank you for watching my videos. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. <laughs> my real eyelashes grew so much to the point where I don't even have to wear falsies because it looks like I have on false eyelashes and I really don't. So get you, stop wearing fake lashes. <laughs> Well, I can't tell you what to do, but if you want longer lashes or if you're pulling out your natural eyelashes with fake lashes, my advice to you is give the fake lashes a rest for a minute. Allow your natural hair to grow out and you'll you'll see like how beautiful they are naturally and get you a really, really good mascara. This mascara that I'm using is from Benefit. It's called Bad Gal. So I'll link this down below as well. Y'all know I link everything down below in the description box. So anything that y'all see me use is nine times out of 10 always down there. And yes, they are affiliate links because this has to get paid. So anything that you click down below is an affiliate link. I am getting paid when you purchase from those links. So if you love me, purchase from me. If you wanna see me make money, take care of my son, do my thing, purchase anything that I have down below that you like, that you wanna try, click the link down below.
Somebody recently, oh, hold on guys. Like I said guys, at this point on my channel, I have no idea what I'm doing at all, but I've learned so much and I've grown so much in my own personal journey. So I know for a fact that I wanna start creating content that reflects that, very uplifting, empowering, positive content, um, lots of advice, Lots of things that I now can share because I've gone through the storm, I've made it out, and I've learned valuable lessons that I really want to share with you guys. So, I have so much stuff on the way. It's just, I got to stay consistent, stay on the grind. Because my channel should have been way farther than where it is right now. But I dealt with a lot of imposter syndrome. I dealt with a lot of like low self-esteem, lack of confidence. I dealt with so many things that now I'm past it and I'm confident in myself. I'm assured in myself. So now I feel like, I just feel really good. I feel good, I'm growing into myself. I'll be 26 this year. Like, honey, like who has time to like not believe in themselves, who has time to not be confident because life life keeps going. Like I said, my channel should have grown so, my channel should be way bigger than what it is. Like saying is, now I know what I'm capable of. I know my full potential and I'm gonna start putting that into my content here on YouTube because I didn't start YouTube because I thought that it was a good way to make some fast money. I started YouTube because I genuinely love creating content and I genuine, genuinely just love sharing my life. So I'm at that place where I can share myself wholeheartedly and not feel the need to go back and delete the video or care about what anybody's gonna say or you know, whatever. So I'm growing, I'm moving forward. I feel good, I feel confident and yeah. So this is my look, natural hair vibes all the time. My man loves my hair when it looks like this. I just did my baby hairs real quick, whoop de whoop. Um, put on some mascara, my, eye my eyebrows look crazy, but I'll get them done later on in the week. Some chapstick and that's it. This is good to go. Oh yeah, and I told y'all I got a new car, so let's go see my baby. So, I don't know why I do this, and I've been doing this for years. I don't wear makeup, but I still set my face. I don't know why. I should just get some rose water. But <laughs> just to give me that fresh, kind of like dewy kind of finish. I said I would show y'all my baby. This is my baby girl. She's dirty right now. But it's mine. She's mine. She's all mine, guys. This is my new car. Oh my goodness. It's a 2017 Hyundai Sonata. She's filthy. But she's mine. what is up guys welcome back to the channel same vlog different day so i am actually on my it's break right now it's a mosquito oh shoot it's a spider <gasps> go run 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 <laughs> so i'm actually on my break right now from work i'm about to put some food in the oven so hopefully it's done by the time i get off of work I am trying to be like super disciplined with my time this week. Um, so yeah, let's get this food in the oven. 
Omar is cleaning up his stuff right now. I just spoke to my boyfriend. He's working. So, yeah. I am just trying to make my life a little bit easier these days. Um, by just being super disciplined with my time and just trying to stay focused, 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 focused. Guys, I am so clumsy. I had to open this and the lid was already off of it. And I went to shake it and it just flew all over the floor. Like I've cleaned most of it up, but oh my goodness. So my oven is preheated, preheating. This is what we're gonna be trying out tonight. This is spinach and cheese manicotti. Hi, Sophie. Say hi. Hi. I named Sadie because I say welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the channel. Okay. It, because I have Roblox, and because I have headphones, I play video games on my my phone. Because Tony, you play video games. Yes, it's because Sonic the Hedgehog Red Roblox. Because okay. Red 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 Roblox. Okay, cut. Okay, now let me finish cleaning up my mess. Oh my goodness. What's next? Sunday. No. Mm? No. Yes. Monday. What's after Monday? Monday is a sun. Monday, Monday. Good job. 
February. February, February. What's after February? Where's it go? Mm -hmm. This? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I don't know. What? Uh -huh. What? January, February. What else? Hmm? March. March! I love March. Mm -hmm. Look, I have my toy and my tonic. What? Yeah. I have March and my tonic. I cause the animal tonic, the March reading books. For March. The big bell wolf, the seven little sheep. Okay? The seven little sheep. The seven little sheep, mommy. Okay. That big bad wolf girl. Okay. Good job, March. January, February, March. What else? I don't know. This one? No, this? April. April? Who is April? April. April. Mm-hmm. Huh? I should where's it go? This? That? This? This? That? May. Oh, May. He likes my girl. He need. Hello, May. He. Oh, my mom, cause because he is my. He name is May. He's a girl. Uh huh. Because we're going. Go for May. <laughs> July. Good job, August. September. 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 Good job. September. September. What's next? October. October. Good job. November. November. Good job. December. November. December. No, baby. November. 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 Good job. December. Good job. Say it for mommy. Start from the top. What's this? Charlie February, March, April, May, June, July, August, August, September, December, November, November, December. <laughs> you, what's this? Um, August. August. September. September. October, October, November, November, December, December. 
Okay, what month are we in? What month are we in right now? This? No, we're in June. Yeah, okay. In June. You know he's the coolest guy. June is the coolest guy ever seen. His name is...